Today I'll be showing you how to do a lateral braid, it's also called an Estonian braid or a Vikel braid or Vikel braid or Vikel braid, I'm sorry, I know I butchered that, but just to let you know that it has several names. It's a very pretty braid, um, it's very stretchy, it's as stretchy as your stockinette is, and it just gives a lovely detail. It looks complicated, it actually really isn't. Uh, so let's get started. So I've made a few rounds of stockinette here and I'm now at the row that I want to do the lateral braid. For this one I have casted on 18 stitches. For the lateral braid it doesn't matter if you have an uneven or even number of stitches. You can do it with how many stitches you want. That's a fun thing. So 18 stitches here. For the lateral braid row you're going to add one here add a stitch here and then at the end you're going to get rid of it here so when you continue knitting you will still have your original amount of stitches like you did here so I'm going to add a stitch by with my right needle I'm going to go through the first and second stitch wrap my yarn around it pull it out and put it on the needle as so so now I have 19 stitches what I'm not going to do now is pretty much the steps you're going to continue doing throughout the row to create the braid. So what you're going to do is first, let's keep this nice separate, you're going to knit the second stitch through the back. So pull it through, keep both stitches on your left. So I've knitted the second stitch through the back, then you knit the first stitch through the front. So now you can slip both of them off your left needle, as so, pull it a little bit tight, and then this stitch, your second stitch on your right needle, you just put it back onto your left needle. This is the one that's going to be the braid. So I'm just going to repeat what I did, just knit the second stitch through the back. Knit the first stitch through the front, slip them both off and slip one back. Knit the second stitch through the back, first one through the front, slip both off the left and then one back on. So you can already see the lateral braid forming here. So I'm just going to continue doing the rest of the row. So I have three stitches left, so I'm just going to repeat the steps one more time. So you knit the second stitch through the back, first one through the front, let's slip both off. This time you don't have to slip this one back. You're just going to knit your last stitch on your row, like so. And as I said, you're now going to decrease a stitch, because otherwise I will continue knitting with 19. 
you do this by slipping this one second to last slip it over your last one and there you have it as you can see it's a, it's a very stretchy and it's very pretty quite straight if this tutorial was uh, helpful please give me a like uh, you can also follow me on Instagram you can follow me on YouTube uh, and you can go to my website thank you bye mm -hmm.